Okay, we're going to continue with public hearings. Uh, we're going to have we have two public hearings this evening. First is to hold the public hearing and extend interim urgency ordinance regulating cultivation and prohibiting the manufacture, processing, laboratory testing, labeling, storing, wholesale, and retail distribution of non-medical marijuana pursuant to Government Code Section 65858A. Mark. to extend the moratorium on commercial marijuana activities in the city. You might all remember that Proposition 64 would, uh, that was passed by a majority of the voters at the last election, would allow most of those commercial activities unless the city were to either ban or regulate them before January 1st of next year. As we discussed last time, the state regulations uh, are still not out yet. We don't know when they're going to be out. But when they do come out, they would cover both medical and non-medical commercial marijuana activities. As you also know, the city already has an ordinance banning uh, medical marijuana distribution facilities or collective cultivations throughout the city. At the last meeting, uh, the city council suggested that we uh, should extend the current moratorium, which would otherwise expire on the 25th of October of this year, for another year until October 25th of 2018. And the reason for that was several fold. Uh, first of all, we would want to find out what the state regulations actually say, because nobody has seen them yet, and those aren't expected to be out until uh, much later this year. And then uh, furthermore, it would allow the city time to study uh, what, if any, regulations it might want to adopt with respect to allowing some degree of commercial marijuana activities in the city. You can extend the current moratorium with a four-fifths vote, and that would extend the moratorium, as I mentioned, to October 25th of 2018. You can, at any time during that, that time, uh, terminate the moratorium sooner than that. Uh, you can adopt a, a, a different ordinance of any kind, and that would be just subject to the direction of the city council. What is currently allowed right now in the city is, of course, the use, possession, ingestion, of marijuana that is allowed by state law. There's, there's state law uh, limits on that uh, for either medical or non-medical use. So this moratorium does not affect anybody's ability to use marijuana subject to whatever state law says, and then uh, also subject to the city's smoking ordinance. So if you can't smoke a cigarette, you can't smoke uh, marijuana. And that will go into effect, uh, as you may recall, in February of next year for multi-unit residences. But aside from that, uh, all other ingestion of marijuana is, is otherwise allowed in the city. Uh, in addition, Proposition 64 uh, allows indoor cultivation of up to no more than six plants for use by a, an adult over the age of 21 who lives at the, at the residence. And that's just for personal use. So the city can't, can't ban that. Uh, Prop 64 says you have to allow that. So aside from, from those two things, the moratorium would prohibit other commercial activities such as distribution, testing, uh, sales, dispensaries, and so on. So the action before you tonight would be to hold a public hearing, take public input, and then uh, we would be looking for a motion to adopt the extension to the urgency ordinance that's in your packet. That concludes my report. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. Any questions for Mark at this time before we open the public hearing? Marty? Quick one. Indoors and outdoors. It's allowed where previous, no? Uh, no, there, so their indoor cultivation of up to six plants is allowed. There is no outdoor cultivation allowed. Okay. If, if, if the moratorium were to go stay in, in effect. Got it, got it. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. okay. Any other questions? All right, this time we're going to open the public hearing. Anyone from the public like to speak to us on this issue? Rotor Rico, 7th Avenue, I would like to have you extend the moratorium. We need to know what the state's doing, and there's no urgency to not extend it. Okay. Thank you. Anyone else? Yep. I'll just follow up with what Robert said. It seems like we should know what the state's going to do before we adopt something before. Thank you. Anyone else? Okay, if I close the public hearing, you're going to be precluded from speaking to us again on this. Uh, Move to close the public hearing. Second. Motion second to close the public hearing. All in favor? Aye. Okay. Any discussion or action by the council? Rico? Does this just take a motion? Or 
Uh, yes, it would be a motion to uh, extend the interim emergency ordinance as uh, presented in the packet. I would move to go ahead and extend the moratorium. Second. There's a motion and a second to extend the moratorium. Any question? All in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? And for the record, okay. that's unanimous. Thank that's you. unanimous, right. Great.